Hello friends today we are going to understand ada model of advertising with different examples in each points first let us understand meaning of ada ada stands for attention interest desire and action ada model was developed by an american businessman and has been in use since the late 19th century The model generally contains some steps that help the owner of the firm to make the sale of his commodity or service. It is generally used in digital marketing, sales strategies and public relations campaign. This model could also be understood as a stimulus response model which means the outside driving force must be applied in a way that the response arose from the other end. ADA model is one of the most widely accepted models which is been in use for more than a century. Now let us understand each steps involved in ADA model. Number 1 attention. The first step in marketing or advertising is to consider how to attract the attention of consumers. They will try to let you know about their products. There are some of the elements that are used to grab people's attention. They are photos, sound, words, videos, illustrations, customers, personality, etc. The main objective of attention is to avoid boring messages and preventing from being ignored. This includes striking colors, large font size, provocative imagery. For example, social media marketing is increasing in this present era. While scrolling your Instagram feeds, we see different brands showing their existence there, hence they recall and recollect our attention there. Number 2, interest. Once the consumer is aware that the product or service exists, business must work on increasing the potential customer's interest level. This is the most challenging step as here you need to make sure that are you able to catch the attention of your targeted customers now the focus of customers will be directed towards the product this could be achieved by telling a story a joke or a punch line or a clever riddle etc for example when a sudden notification pops reading new year sale then this notification arouses a feeling of interest among us we think about shopping when the sale will arrive number 3 desire after the consumer is interested in the product or service then the goal is to make consumer desire it moving toward mindset from i like it to i want it There is a lot of competition in the market nowadays hence one's reason for buying the product are weighed on emotions that means advertisements generally target the emotional aspect for a particular goods or service to create a desire for example in the context of cosmetics when models are shown putting on their makeup using different tools and products of a brand for which they are advertising creates a sense of desire among us we begin to crave like i too want to have these number 4 action the ultimate goal is to drive the receiver of the marketing campaign to initiate action and purchase the product or service advertising is activity that leaves a lasting effect on the consumer's mind and hence they decide to convert that desire into actions Various websites put their testimonies so that they can further encourage the consumer to click on buying options. For example, when we wish list something into our cart on any shopping app, the app generally acknowledges us that we have left something from buying. This recalling can convert our desire into action for buying that particular commodity. Therefore the ADA model says that awareness leads to interest which leads to desire and finally action So friends I believe that from my video you understand ADA model of advertising in detail Thanks for watching my video